Hello, it's Eno. Today, I would like to talk about the theme, Los Angeles and Long Beach Port Dock Workers in North America, Continue Job Action Targeting Automated Terminals. ILWU District 13 Dock Workers at the U.S. Ports, of Los Angeles and Long Beach continue to engage in provocative behavior, most recently targeting automated terminals, according to reports. Longshoremen red tagged cargo handling equipment, at three automated terminals, of Los Angeles and Long Beach ports designating them, as unsafe and forcing equipment inspections. This forced the terminals, to shut down for an entire day. ILWU District 13, the largest regional organization on the West Coast, has embraced a variety of means, to disrupt logistics at Southern California ports, since late last year and early this week. This week, they targeted mainly automated terminals. PM has said in a statement that, these illegal actions are disrupting, the functioning of its largest terminals, which are critical to the movement of freight, to markets throughout the United States. Frustrated by the lack of progress, in West Coast labor negotiations, and the resulting diversion of freight, a coalition of 238 U.S. shippers and transportation officials, last month asked the White House, to intervene in the negotiations. It seems that, the ILWU has been starting to act, a little harassing lately. Last week, they suddenly shut down the terminal, for 24 hours, and this time, they forced a facilities inspection, and shut down the terminal again for 24 hours. It has been almost a year, since labor management negotiations began, in May 2022. The last labor management negotiations also took, nearly a year and were finally settled, with government intervention. At the end of the article, the parties involved made a request, for White House intervention, and it may be time to move toward, the end of labor management negotiations. It would be nice, if the negotiations were to end smoothly, but what will happen? I will keep you updated.